Hello, this is Morantari. Welcome to Promotion 7. Promotion 7 has got a lot of nice tools, and we're going to go over those real quick. The first one that I want to go over with you is the, um, the Draw 3D option. Now, to those that don't have a Nostromo N52, which I highly recommend, you use stereo, you use Alt W to invoke the stereo delta uh, plus positive, and Alt Q to invoke stereo delta negative. So let's do that real quick. To do smart copy, which is what I recommend starting with, you do Alt H, and that's what we're going to do right now. You see the stereo divider? And let's just draw something very simple like a fish. So as you notice that this is in the exact same position as the, um, on one side as it is in the other side. And if you look up here, it says zero. Well, you can change that and that changes your stereo delta. So let's really quickly draw the body of the fish. Okay. Let's fill that in real quick. And let's put the, the fin a little bit behind in the background. So the way I'm going to do that is I'm going to alter the delta. Let's uh, put it back one. Let's make another fin that's in front. So I'm going to do that by plussing the delta. So we'll add one. Let's add two. Now if you cross your eyes, you'll see that fish in 3D. It's a really nifty trick. Okay, well, let's move right along and show you 3D splines. So, we're going to use the um, We're going to use the smart copy for that. Let's go over here and let's choose curve. So I'm going to turn this into zero. I'm going to make a line right here. I'm going to change the line to three and I'm going to make this two. Now, if you look at that in 3D, it looks like it's coming at you like a three-dimensional spline. It's a really neat technique, and it's really, really useful. Let's take a look at the 3D cloner. I have this character that I created, and we're going to clone him into 3D. So let's go do clone, which is Control Alt, Alt J. Let's put his body at zero.
see, I think I'm on the wrong layer. There we go. Let's put this like in front. This like in back. This arm in back. And this arm in front. Let's keep the head at zero. And there you have it, if you look at it. Oh, gotta add the gun. <laughs> if you cross your eyes, it'll be in 3D. Okay, now as you might have noticed, we have an update system right over here, if you look over here, and that's really cool, but not everybody has a, um, a 3D screen, so it's also available in Anaglyph, which is really useful. And the layer system's a lot better. Now you can do layers and animation at the same time. And I made this little animation, a little bouncing ball. But what's really cool is the way that the layers work now. You can go over here, click this on, and you can change these, slide them the way that you want. Each one represents the frame that it's on. These are the frames in the future. These are the frames in the past in back of you and adjust that and completely have control of your animation. Then you can turn it off. It's called light table. And just bounce it all around. It's really nice. Lastly, let's show you, show you three-dimensional fill. They're really cool. So let's turn on Smart Copy. Let's um, make a shape, a circle, and then let's make a fill. Let's change this to like circular, circular gradient. And then let's change the, uh, the delta up here to let's say seven let's move that over there now when you look at it in 3d it's going to pop out at you and that's it guys those are the uh the new tools available for promotion 7 hope you enjoyed this video and have a nice day